Hello! <laughs> so this isn't actually Glorious Insights. This is some extra stuff that we're recording. Um, yeah, your mic is picking up the peach. <laughs> <laughs> At least it's not on the fuzzy side. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Unlike that fruit. Is, is it peaches that are fuzzy? Yes, that's correct. Nectarines are not. Right, it's nectarines that are a smooth one. I prefer a smooth fruit as opposed <laughs> to fuzzy. Yeah, me too. How about you? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. My favorite are cherries and raspberries. I can't, can't pull anything sexual from raspberry, but cherries. Yeah. Now, there's at least two entendres right there. Well, I was going to say, you just like to be able to pop in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> See, you said that you couldn't, but I did. Yeah, fair enough. It's just a, not. It's a talent. It's yeah, really, it's, it's a talent. My servers aren't server engaged just yet. Those ones. <coughs> it happens when you when it's just the way of the road. So I wish I had planned this better. <laughs> yeah. Something to talk about. I did have something on the way home, mm -hmm. and then I didn't. So I guess we're going to talk about how we have nothing to talk about. Is this a whole? Is this is this a whole ten minutes? Is that what's happening? We're doing. I have no yeah. idea. Um, okay. No, we're going to do two. Whichever one this one is is whatever it is. We're starting um, late, so this is probably the short one. Okay. This cool. is probably going to be just the short, um, the short online promo, as opposed to the thing that airs during the other show. Right. Okay. So, okay. and this is, actually, yeah, that's exactly what this is going to be, because this is really appropriate, because this is exactly <laughs> what our show is like. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, sure, sure. Um, you know what's pissing me off today? Fucking Pokemon Go, with its not working of the, um, the, um, the map. No? Is, there's been problems? Tracking, yeah, tracking is not working. Ah, uh, I haven't, uh... I've heard about that being an issue. Have you done the update? Yes. Yeah, I downloaded the latest version from the Android store, at least. Yep. Yeah, I did, too. Um, yeah. Haven't regret oh, I haven't really used it a whole lot. Well, I, I've, I used it... Well, I mean, I opened it up today as, as soon as it was done downloading, and, you know, sure enough, it's like, there's nine Pokemon in the grid, and all of them have three tracks. And and then a Pokemon spawns right in front of me, and the tracker doesn't change. So okay, well, obviously this is not functioning. <laughs> yeah, that that would be problematic. Yeah, like it's interesting because it like it it just, it seems to be sort of accurate. Like I think I think it does give someone an idea of what's in the area, um, but it does not give you an idea of the direction to go in or how far you are from it. Well, everything or, or is three paces. Else. Everything is three paces. According to that, according to it, yeah. because glitch. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, but like, you know, the the being a game designer in part for one thing, you know, I'm just kind of like, like, okay, like, is it is it totally broken, or is it is it, or just parts of it broken? Are some things working? Um, like, I've noticed that um, the uh, the little bar when it's just the three, when it's been, you know, when you minimize the tracker, um, that one seems to be kind of accurate. It's it, like it it seems to update, and it will be in a different order than the other one, like when you expand it. Um, so, I mean, I don't know. I, it's uh, it's definitely, like, it's a guessing game, which is, from a game design perspective, kind of the good thing about it, that people don't really know exactly how it works, so they spend a lot of time talking about it and trying to figure it out. Yeah. So, maybe it was on purpose. Maybe. Uh, I can't see them necessarily doing that. But well, not on purpose, but, well, but no, it's like, oh, like, oh, oh it's very, that was intentional. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, you know well, what? Now you got us. We'll figure. We'll, we'll fix it. But that was on purpose. You know what might have happened too. That's that's all. That's definitely possible. Um, the other thing I've seen happen is, um, um, you know, something is broken and everybody's talking about it. It's like, oh man, we need to fix this bug. Um, and and then marketing's like, whoa, whoa, whoa. We're we're gonna fix the bug, for sure. But we're just gonna give them a little bit of time to get a little upset, talk about it, you know, like, once we hit the front page of Reddit, 
you know, that's that's when it's like, hey, good news, everybody. We're going to release the patch early just for you guys. <clears throat> like the professor, good news, everybody. Exactly. <laughs> so, yeah, you know, I, it's, it's very cynical. But, I mean, if Nintendo had licensed this to EA, not only would the game be a million times worse, but... It that would probably have been a likely scenario, you know. Like they release the game, and it's probably you know, it's probably just tracking is more complicated. The servers are fucking slammed, you know, checking a username and password. Yeah, so there's not enough processing power left over to do fuck all else. 